the U.S. Surgeon General has given out a grim uh, projection on the outbreak in the United States, comparing the coronavirus pandemic there to Pearl Harbor and the 9-11 attacks. In other re news related to the coronavirus internationally, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson has been admitted to hospital well over a week after he tested positive for the coronavirus. And the number of cases in Japan continues to soar. Some welcome developments uh, as well, though, we must point out. Italy, uh, which is Europe's hardest hit country, may be on the road to recovery. Spain as well. Kim Jae-hee reports. The U.S. is bracing for the worst period of the coronavirus outbreak. Speaking on Fox News on Sunday, U.S. Surgeon General Jerome Adams said the coming week is going to be the hardest and the saddest in most Americans' lives. He also said the predicted death toll in the coming weeks could be a Pearl Harbor moment and a 9-11 moment, only it's going to be happening all over the country. U.S. President Donald Trump also warned that COVID-19 deaths in the U.S. will rise over the next one to two weeks. Speaking to reporters at the White House over the weekend, he said America's toughest week of the outbreak is coming up and warned there will be lots of deaths, possibly on the same level as the two world wars. Meanwhile, Japan is also seeing its number of infections soar. The daily confirmed cases in Japan exceeded 300 for three straight days. The total number of infections there now stands at over 4,500, with the death toll topping 100. Over in the UK, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson was admitted to hospital on Sunday for tests after suffering from coronavirus symptoms 10 days after testing positive for the virus. The news of his hospitalization followed Queen Elizabeth's address to the nation that said better days will return when COVID-19 is defeated. Together we are tackling this disease, and I want to reassure you that if we remain united and resolute, then we will overcome it. Better days will return. Meanwhile, some European countries are showing signs of improvement. One of the hardest hit countries, Italy, reported 525 deaths on Sunday, its lowest number of daily deaths in two weeks. Spain's death rate is also starting to fall. The country's daily number of deaths dropped for the third straight day on Sunday with 674 new deaths. Kim Jae-hee, Arirang News.